how we do with time. Okay. Um, this probably deserves an explanation. Um, I went to uh, Barbie's uh, Dreamhouse experience a couple of days ago. Really good. Um, I didn't think they were going to let me in um, because I'm a 33 year old man with a beard who often gets stopped if I try and go to America because they think I might be Al Qaeda or something. You know? <laughs> So I thought I might not be allowed into Barbie's dream world where three-year-olds do catwalk shows. <laughs> but I was allowed in. And they, they actually welcomed uh, me and my friend Zena, uh, my friend and PA, Zena Krause. Could she have a round of applause? She really is amazing. Um, they, uh, they welcomed us in. And in Barbie's dream, has any, have any of you been? No? It's just me and Zena. Um, in Barbie, you can go into all the rooms of her house, including her toilet. And in Barbie's toilet is um, a pink dolphin. It's coming out of the toilet. Just its head. And um, I said to one of Barbie's friends, the people who work there called Barbie's friends, I said, why is there, why is there a dolphin in her toilet? Does she... Is this something she has to have to defecate onto? Is it something? And they said, no, no, Ken put it there. Ken put it there. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> add, to, add to another dynamic to Barbie that I hadn't really sort of thought about, you know, sort of aquatic um, feces. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> Okay, I'd like to dedicate this song to Barbie's Dreamhouse experience. <laughs> uh, feel free to dance. I mean, I know you're all seated, but normally I have a real good circle pit here. And feel free to get up on stage and jump, you know, do some crowd surfing. It's a, it's a strange gig when people don't do that. <laughs> okay, how would have time, okay? Something more than 